Welcome to This Week in Salina, your look at what's happening in the City of Salina government. The City Commission meets on Monday, November 6th. The 2.30 p.m. study session continues the presentation of the Parks Master Plan update from October 16th. At the regular 4 p.m. meeting, commissioners will consider an ordinance on second reading changing the zoning at 255 South Chicago Street to allow for additional parking for the Salina Emergency Aid Food Bank. Also on the agenda, a loan agreement with the state of Kansas to complete an inventory of water lines that contain lead, an amendment to a loan agreement with the Kansas Department of Health and Environment for improvements to the wastewater treatment plant, and authorization of a notice of proposed transfer of park property at Founders Park to allow for Theater Salina to expand their facility. The City Commission will also consider a contract for energy saving improvements to multiple city facilities and authorization of funding for the improvements. An executive session is scheduled under the attorney-client privilege exception to the Kansas Open Meetings Act to discuss points of negotiation with Salina Destination Development and the Kansas Department of Commerce for the city's multifamily housing project. Possible action may follow. Other scheduled meetings this week include the Planning Commission, Tuesday, November 7th at 4 p.m., and the Animal Control Advisory and Appeals Board, Wednesday, November 8th at 4 p.m. The meeting agendas will be available on the city's website, salina-ks.gov. You can watch all City of Salina meetings on Salina TV, Cox Cable Channel 20, online at salina-tv.com, on Facebook on the City of Salina page, and on YouTube on the City of Salina channel. A new exhibit is now open at the Smoky Hill Museum. A place to call home explores the settling of Kansas. Whether on foot, horseback, wagon, train, or boat, they came. The great immigration of settlers into Kansas started in the mid-1850s, swelled after the Civil War, and continued through the late 1800s. In this exhibit, hear from those who risked it all through diary entries. These stories share the decisions immigrants made, the hardships they faced, and the hope that brought them to Kansas. A place to call home is on display until March 23, 2024. For more information, please visit the museum's website at smokyhillmuseum.org or call the museum at 785-309-5776. General Services staff will be conducting curbside leaf collection from November 6th to December 29th, weather permitting, subject to change depending on when leaves actually begin to fall. Rake and pile leaves between the curb and sidewalk. If no sidewalk exists, pile leaves directly behind the curb. Leaves will be collected according to this schedule. Have leaves ready on the first day of the schedule, and there will be only one round of collections in each zone. For questions or more information, please call General Services at 785-309-5750. Just a reminder, City of Salina offices will be closed Friday, November 10th to observe the Veterans Day holiday. Offices will reopen on Monday, November 13th. Thanks for watching This Week in Salina. Have a great week!